The following program has been made possible by the friends and partners of Christ for All Nations. My name is Daniel Kalenda. I'm a missionary evangelist who preaches to millions each year alongside evangelist Reinhard Bonnke in Africa and across the world. At our gospel outreaches, we are witnessing an outpouring of the Holy Spirit that is winning astonishing numbers of people to Christ, one soul at a time. The Lord is also divinely healing broken bodies and restoring lives to the glory of God Almighty. Now, I want to invite you to hear the gospel, see and experience God's miraculous touch, and discover the mission of Christ for all nations. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Christ for All Nations. I'm evangelist Daniel Kalenda, and I'm coming to you today live directly from the crusade field here in Southeast Africa, the city of Bluntia, Malawi, where we are in the middle of one of our great gospel crusades. And I'm sure you can see it all around me. There are thousands and thousands of people that have gathered here to hear the word of God, to receive a miracle. They are excited. There is a palpable sense of excitement and electricity in the air. What a joy it is to be here in this environment. I wish every single one of you could be here in person, but my video is the next best thing. And today we are going to have a wonderful time together. And I wanna do something very special for all of you that are watching. I want you to be able to plug in to what is happening here. I want you to be able to tap in to this anointing. We have been seeing amazing healings and miracles. Last night there, was, there were two ladies with large tumors. Those tumors instantly vanished during the prayer. Uh, ladies with blind eyes that were open, cripples walking, and all kinds of amazing miracles. And these miracles are available to you today through prayer. And at the end of the program, I'm going to be praying for you, for your prayer requests, and I believe the power of God is going to flow through that lens, through that television screen, and touch you in Jesus' name. And I want to do something special. I have one of these red prayer cloths. I love the color of this because it reminds us of the healing power of the blood of Jesus. And if you need prayer today, for a physical healing, I'm going to send you one of these in the mail after we've laid hands on it and prayed for it. And this is not a gimmick. You can't buy this. It, it, there are no strings attached to it. You can't buy it for any amount. We're just going to send it to you for free. Our way of connecting our faith with yours and believing for a mighty touch from the Lord for you. So if you need prayer, I want you to use that contact information on your screen. Get in touch with us and let us know how we can pray for your needs today in Jesus' name. Now, as we enter into the Christmas holiday season, I just want to, on behalf of Evangelist Bonke and the entire Christ for All Nations team, I want to say very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I pray that the blessings of God would be with you and yours this holiday season. We love you and we appreciate you, your prayers and your support all throughout the year. It means so very, very much to us. Now, what I would like to do before we go to the ministry part of this episode, I want to share with you a testimony to build your faith. You know, I told you we've been seeing these incredible miracles. Now I want you to see one of them with your own eyes. I believe your faith is going to be built. Your heart is going to be prepared for your own miracle from God. Have a look at this. I've had this toothache for over five years now. And it's, when it started, it was not this intense. It was just a little ache and then it stops. But after, throughout the years, it's, it's, in, it's got uh, strong. It's been intense and it, got, it affected my nerves. It got to my nerves, my ears, and most of the times my brain. And it's giving me so much holes in my teeth. Most of the times it affects even my gums. There is no way I can chew. Even the least of things, the softest things, I cannot chew them. I have to swallow. I am somebody who likes to read where there is no noise. I like to read in my own quiet place. So most of the times it disturbs me because when it affects my ears, it gives, it makes a sound in my head. And that sound affects my brain in a way that I cannot concentrate. I always have to lie down. And even when I lie down, I feel very uncomfortable. It always, it affects me. I just have to lie somewhere very cold without any noise, not even the least, not even the voice. 
there is a, a local doctor that my mom always buys drugs for me. He prescribes some drugs for me, and so I take them. Usually, I am always on drugs. I cannot go a week without taking drugs because if I do, that means that week I've wasted it because there will be no way for me to do anything. At times, I have to skip classes or maybe leave the class, not to get noise because in school, the environment is very noisy. My mom purchases drugs almost every week for me in order for me to calm down my nerves because that is the only way I can succeed in reading or doing any other thing. When the evangelist was praying, I was so praying with him. And then I started screaming. I started screaming so hard. I could scream like first, at first I could not scream. When I screamed like that, I started feeling pain in my head. But then I screamed so hard. Like it wasn't paining, I wasn't feeling the pain. And then I started hitting my face because usually I don't like people touching my face because if you touch it, it's like I just start feeling pain. So I started hitting my face and I felt no pain. I started hitting my teeth, hitting my teeth together. And I felt no pain, that's when I discovered Oh, this is a miracle, and I said I cannot share it, I cannot enjoy it by myself. I have to tell the glory of God. Now, sister, tell me what was wrong with you. No I have teeth problem. All my teeth have holes. I could not chew when 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 I take sugar or something hot. I feel my nerves. They would pain me a lot. Up to this evening, I still had pains. Jusqu'à ce soir, j'avais des douleurs. And these drugs, I take, I take them to calm the nerves down. Et je prenais ces... And when they were praying, Mais quand on priait, I felt the power of God. J'ai senti la puissance de and Dieu. right now, I can hit my chin. Maintenant, je peux taper ma joue. And there is no more pain. Et il a plus de douleur. There is no more pain. Il a plus de douleur. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There's no pain, I know I'm not feeling pain and everything. I could hit my gum, I could touch my gum and nothing. So it was it was a great sensation. I felt really blessed. I felt I don't know if everybody understands me, but I know what I felt and I know how I feel right now because since yesterday I've not had any pain, not even a headache, nothing. Since yesterday and now when I got back home I ate, I didn't I was not afraid and I told my I told my parents, I am healed. You know, my friend, what you are seeing and experiencing and witnessing today is the real deal. We are literally seeing millions of people coming to Christ. The gospel is being confirmed with signs and wonders and miracles, the outpouring of the Holy Spirit, deliverance from demons, and every imaginable demonstration of the power of the gospel happening right here on the fields in Africa. And if your heart is burdened to see this great end time harvest of souls going forward and touching the next generation here in Africa and around the world, I want to ask you very boldly today to make a decision to stand with the ministry of Christ for all nations through your prayers and through your monthly giving. We call this monthly ministry partnership. It is a blessed, blessed covenant relationship. I myself am a partner with the ministry because I believe in it so much and it's been a great blessing to me and my family and I want you to join as well. Here's how you can be a part. To date, Christ for All Nations has seen over 74 million people make decisions for Christ in our gospel campaigns around the world. We are winning millions to Christ and reaping a harvest like never before. You can be a part of this great mission. Every dollar counts and every action matters. Sign up today and become a monthly ministry partner at cfan.tv. You know, my friend, our monthly ministry partners are more than just ministry partners. We really are a community. We're a family. We pray for one another. We support one another. In fact, right here at this crusade today, there are some of our partners from different nations in the world. We invite all of our ministry partners to come and to participate and to see these crusades live and in person. And I tell you, their lives are never the same again. I want to say thank you in advance to those of you who are going to stand with us as ministry partners. And I want to send you something today. I know it's a small thing, but it's a token of our love and our thanks. It's this new book that we have just published called 
Impact Africa. It is a full color, powerful book filled with stories and filled with exploits for the gospel, nations shaken, bodies healed, people raised from the dead. This book will rock your world, it will, sh it will shake you, and it will build your faith. I wanna sign one of these and get it into the mail to you right away as a way of saying thank you for becoming a monthly ministry partner today in Jesus' name, amen. Well, in the spirit of the Christmas season, I wanna do something very special today. I want to play for you a message that we recently recorded with our founder, Evangelist Ryan Harbonke. We went to his house and we sat there with him at the fireplace and he began to t talk to us about the Christmas story and pour out his heart. It was a precious, precious moment and I wanna share it with you right now. Hello, I'm Reinhard Bonnke. It's Christmas again. What a wonderful feast and a glorious celebration. Christmas, I've been thinking about it, is the centerpiece of time. I think one could call it the pivot of time. Everything we measure time-wise is before Christ or after Christ, BC or AD. And the birth of Christ is right there to be found. Everything centers on him. Jesus Christ forever. Yesterday, today and forever. To save Israel, God sent Moses, he sent Joshua, and others. But to save us, he sent nobody. He came himself. Jesus came, the Son of God. He in person, imagine, he in person came for you and came for me. And then we read in Revelation 3, verse 20, when Jesus says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. I pray that Christmas may be just like that, that you will hear a knock on your door. And when you open, it is Jesus who is asking to be let in. The whole world is passing us by, rushing us by, flying by, racing by. No time for us. But here comes Jesus. It's Christmas, knocking at the doors of our hearts. He wants to come in. Another wonderful fact about Christmas is that when Jesus was born, he was born as Savior. Luke 2.11 says so, for there is born to you this day in the city of David a Savior who is Christ the Lord. There is born to us a King as the wise men uh, had learned he was born Savior. Jesus was born King. Democracy decreed Christ's death, but not his kingship. Nobody made Jesus a king. He was born as a king, not as a prince who then one day would become a king. He was born king, the king of kings and the Lord of lords. It struck me just this day, nobody ever crowned Jesus except with thorns. But one day we will see our Lord crowned 
in glory in heaven. We will never crown him. The, the major crowns the lesser, not the lesser the major. He will crown us if we follow him, but he is crowned. He was born king. He is still king and he will remain king forever and ever. Isaiah and also the psalmist prayed, Oh, that thou wouldest rend the heavens and come down. I sometimes hear people still pray this prayer, begging the Lord to please rent the heavens and come down. I've got good news for you. He came down 2,000 years ago. He is here by the Holy Spirit. He is accessible. His arms are wide open. His hands nail pierced. It is this Jesus, our Jesus, the Lord of all, the Savior of the world, the King of kings and the Lord of lords. And in this spirit and with this truth, I wish all of you a very merry and happy Christmas. My friend, I hope that you enjoyed that very personal and intimate uh, word from Evangelist Bonke. I always love to hear him talk in, a, in an environment like that where he's just sharing his heart. And I know it was a great blessing to you. I want you to remember, we are coming close to the end of this broadcast and we're going to be laying hands on your prayer requests and extending our faith toward you. And so I want you to take advantage of this opportunity right now. It's probably the last chance you'll get in the broadcast to get in touch with us, use that contact information on your screen and let us know how we can stand together with you in faith for your miracle in Jesus name. We are here in this amazing context in Bluntai, Malawi, the very last night of our gospel crusade here where we have seen Jesus doing amazing things all week. And as you look around this place, I wanna ask you here at the end of the year, if you feel led to partner with us in a very special way, every penny of that gift will go towards helping the gospel to be proclaimed as never before here on the African continent. Here's how you can get involved in this very important project. We often call this the holiday season, but we all know the enemy doesn't take a holiday and a hardworking ministry never quits. Dear friend, we need to finish the year financially strong. And we believe it can happen if everyone would be willing to give even a little, so the Lord could use it to get a lot of crucial things done for our next soul winning campaigns. Can you help us? Please ask the Lord if he would help you give a special year end offering of love and support today. We depend on the Holy Spirit to speak to the hearts of our friends and partners to be a part of this soul-winning ministry. If he's prompting you to give today, please say yes, and please don't wait. In fact, give your gift as a year-end seed for the new year harvest you need. Please call right now. Thank you and God bless you. Today for your gift of any amount, when you help us with this project, I want to send you uh, this brand new devotional by evangelist Reinhard Bonnke. You know, we're coming up to the beginning of a new year, and this is an amazing year-long personal devotional Bible study plan. I want to send it to you as a way of saying thank you for helping us with this project in Jesus' name. Now, as I told you, and as I promised at the beginning, we are here in this amazing environment where miracles are taking place. And now, my friend, I want to pray for you and I wanna pray for your prayer needs in Jesus' name. And I really believe that the same miracles we've been experiencing right here in Bluntai, Malawi, you are going to experience in your life, in your home, in your body, in the name of Jesus. Now, this box in front of me is filled with prayer requests. 
Many of them, most of them, have come from all different places in the world. I've told you many times that we take your prayer request seriously, and this is the living proof of it. We have literally hand carried these requests that have been bathed in prayer at our headquarters in Orlando. We have brought them here to the crusade field where tonight, at the end of the service, thousands and thousands of people are gonna be praying over them. And I believe that God is going to answer them in mighty power. But as we're here today together, I wanna to pray for them and I wanna pray for you in real time. And so this is what I'm gonna ask you to do. If you need a miracle in your body, just as an act of faith and as a point of contact, I want you to stretch your hand towards that screen right now and I'm gonna pray for you. Father, I thank you for the healing miracle power that is in the name of Jesus Christ. And right now, Lord, I release that power into the lives and in the bodies and into the situations of every person watching. I rebuke sickness and I rebuke disease. I rebuke infirmity and pain. I command it to get out of your body and I say be healed in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as I lay my hands upon these prayer requests, Lord, I thank you that you have read each and every one. You know each and every need. Lord, you know those that have physical needs. You know those who have family needs. Father, I pray that you would bring home prodigal sons and daughters. Lord, I pray that you would give breakthrough in the financial situations of people. Lord, bless businesses and families. And Lord, in Jesus' name, may your kingdom be built. Lord, I pray for pastors, for churches that are crying out for revival. Lord, would you answer them with fire, I pray, in Jesus' name. Lord, let your kingdom come, let your will be done. In the name of Jesus, I pray. And everybody said, amen. Amen. My friend, once again, let me remind you, if you have a physical ailment, I want to send you one of our red prayer cloths today to just lay on your body as a point of contact. There are no strings attached. You cannot buy this. It's not a gimmick. It's just a way of connecting our faith with yours as they did in the book of Acts chapter 19. And I believe it's going to be used by God as a point of contact for a miracle. If you still need prayer or if you have a praise report, I want to invite you to use the contact information on your screen. Get in touch with us. Let us know how we can continue to pray for you or how we can rejoice with you over what Jesus has done for you today. I look forward to hearing from you. And don't go away. I have some very special announcements in Jesus' name. God bless. Hello. Join me in Atlanta for the Reinhardt Bonnke Gospel Crusade on March 5th and 6th, 2016 at the Phillips Arena in downtown Atlanta. It is a totally free event, and I'm asking that all believers will bring the lost. We cannot make this crusade success without your help. Visit our website and sign up now. We are all guilty, and we all need salvation. Today is your day of salvation. All hail the power of Jesus' name! We are so excited about the upcoming Gospel Crusade happening in Atlanta, Georgia. I really hope that every single one of you is able to be there. It's going to be an amazing event happening March 5th and 6th. That's next year, 2016, at the Phillips Arena, Atlanta, Georgia. And then the One Thing Conference, Kansas City, Missouri. This year, December 28th through 31st, I'm going to be there with Ryan Harbalke, Mike Bickle, Francis Chan, uh, Stephanie Gretzinger, and many, many others. It's going to be a wonderful year-end event. And then Azusa Now with Lou Engel, Los Angeles, California, happening in the Los Angeles Coliseum next year, April 9th, 2016. We are expecting 120,000 people to pack out that Coliseum. It is going to be a historic spiritual event for the nation in Jesus' name. And then we're going to be having an impartation breakfast in San Antonio, January 23rd, 2016. I'll be there with Reinhard Bonnke, and it will be a time of laying out of hands and praying and receiving from the Lord for each and every one of you. I hope that I see you there. If you want to find out about any of these events or other events that we're doing, you can go to my website, danielcalenda.com slash events. Click on that link and you will see all of the different events listed there with websites and dates and so forth. I hope I get to see you very soon at one of these events. God bless you. Bye-bye.
We all need a savior and his name is Jesus. He wants to walk hand in hand with you. Are you happy? Today is your day of salvation. Now is your time of salvation. This week is your week of salvation. If you believe that tonight, shout hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The soul felt its worth. A thrill of hope. A Tonight you may come here as weak as can be. You will go home like a conqueror with Jesus inside of you. Jesus, I surrender my life to you. There is power in the blood of Jesus. Jesus. He is alive. And because he is alive, all of us can live. And all of us can have eternal life here tonight. To learn more about the mission and ministry of Christ for all nations, please visit our website. You can write to us at CFAN, P.O. Box 590356, Orlando, Florida, 32859. Visit our prayer site to share a prayer request or testimony. Thank you for helping win millions to Christ, one soul at a time. The preceding program has been made possible by the friends and partners of Christ for All Nations.